rich soil which the nutrients that are in the soil are absorbed into the grass so you get the nutrients into the grass right yeah. when you go into the wild fields it's like it has all the nutrients in it absorbed because what happens there is the same that happens with those people in Kansas the grass has been like dormant over the whole winter and assimilating the stuff and then comes the fresh shoot and all the fresh power is in that first thing that's why the first cut of the grass right now is the most rejuvenative yeah in spring mm -hmm. has the most rejuvenative mm -hmm. power once you cut it, it grows again. It grows again. You cut it. It's like these people in Kansas. So, you know, when the grass is ready for the jaunting stage, they harvest the whole thing, mow the whole thing, and then it all grows back. And then they let it grow to seed and produce the seeds and sell the weed still. But they got the grasses out of it too. Very smart, you know. They're called pines. The wheatgrass people, they call themselves. I'm sure they're selling some of their products here too. They're huge in the stage. Because they did all this research and they found if you actually dry the grass that you still get lots of benefits. Sure, it's not as energetic as like the fresh stuff, you know, but you still get plenty of benefits from it. And the benefits is always, you know, good energy.